<laughs> Good evening guys, this is Chewy from Wire Jeepney and I'm here to show you the package I just received which contains some of the items I recently purchased from GCT Studios for the game Bushido. Um, they recently launched the second edition called The Risen Sun and we were able to pre-order and get our hands on the rulebook and some of the limited edition figures that came with it. So I'll be flipping through some of the pages of the newest and very first rule book in the Philippines. Sorry John and Jay for beating you to it. I guess I'm more of a VIP in the post office nowadays. So so this is going to be a short review of, uh, of the, the rule book and I'll show you some of the figures. So please bear with me. So now I'm gonna show some of the pages to see the art. Uh, but for the rules itself, we'll probably make a separate video for it. The resident war jeepers will be the ones to review the rules. Uh, as reading is not my strongest suit, because as, as I've won games by misreading the rules. So pardon me if I won't read the text to not misinform the four viewers of, of this video. So let's open the book. So it feels like a magazine. Um, the pages are glossy. It smells like uh, the Magic the Gathering box uh, card unboxing. The ink smells terrific. Um, you'll be able to see some of the faction art now in Bushido. Now in Bushido, there are I think eight or nine factions that you can choose from. Uh, all the factions are already represented by the Bushido Philippines uh, group. Maybe in separate videos we can showcase each so that anyone interested to join the game um, can have a brief history of the factions and decide from there. So watch out for that. So the only part that caught my eye in the rulebook is the part wherein it explained the card stats. So whenever you purchase a starter sets or blisters, so these are some of the blisters, uh, including the limited edition figures. Uh, this is uh, the starter set. So whenever you pur purchase uh, the sets or the blisters, uh, cards will be included uh, for for individual models. So this is for easier reference um, during games. Uh, this is quite helpful for people like me who tend to easily forget character stats. So you can actually purchase the new replacement cards um, for the people who purchased the first edition models like these guys. So you can replace the old cards. Uh, you can purchase separately from the website. So it's, I forget, oh, I forgot how much uh, this costs. So you can check it online. And then, so let's flip some more, but I, I, I won't spend a lot of time flipping through the pages. So let's just show some of the art. So, I'm not really familiar with some of the uh, factions here. Or the, oh, maybe this one, uh, the, the scary guys. I think um, these are Jay's um, uh, Cult of Yure. So, I hate to play against these guys. So, let's move over to the figures. So, before I end the video, um, I'll show you some of the figures I purchased, uh, which have really nice cups. It's actually worth the money. Um, the good thing about this this game is it's easy to learn. Uh, it's inexpensive, inexpensive to collect as you only need about four or five models. In this case, um, my models are big. So usually uh, in a tournament setting, you only need um, 100 points. So um, my, my big guys are, are both 20, 22 points each. So four or five models, you're, you're good to go. Uh, the next good, good thing about um, this game is that you'll only need about uh, a 2 by 2 playing area. So bringing a small game mat to a Starbucks is possible. So what Tara says all the time, a starter is all you need. So let's check out uh, the other sculpt. Uh, this one is one, one of the limited uh, edition figures. Uh, he is the... I think he's the elder brother. No, no, the drunken master. He's a uh, Hiroto. It's hard to get the focus. But anyway, uh, this is the other limited edition figure. This is his brother, the elder brother. I don't know if his if this guy is really his brother. And then my favorite character, this guy, because he looks like me. So. As I've mentioned, this is just a short um, video review. So there you have it. Uh, GCT Studios, the shortest and probably the crappiest rulebook review you'll ever find in YouTube. So I'll see you again next time. 
Uh, hopefully, my war jeepney crew will allow me to publish more videos. And peace out. So this is how I look like. <laughs> Thank you.